Hey guys, and welcome back to my very boring white wall and my very poorly dim lit channel. Bear with me, brand new at this, my audio sucks, my video sucks, my lighting sucks. I'll invest in some nicer products a little bit later down the line if I continue to do reviews. Anyway, moving on. Uh, my name is Kate Searles, if I didn't already say that before. I'm here to do what I'm going to call a quick minute review, which is reviews of products that I've gotten, but I cut right to the chase whether I like them or not. And today we're doing the review on this, which is the St. Tropez One Night Only Gloss. Uh, to cut to the chase, I don't like this. There, I don't like it. You can get out of this video, you know my opinion of it, I don't like it. But the reason why I don't like this is it's a, it's a gloss. It's very oily. It's very, uh, I have a hard time with it drying down on my skin. So it's very like sticky throughout the night. And I don't like that it's one of those things where you wash it off. I went into Sephora a couple weeks ago during that VIB sale. Oh gosh, I guess that was a couple months ago now, but Anyway, I went into the sale they were having a couple months ago, and I wanted a, um, like a, I wanted to get the Cover FX highlighting drops, and I wanted to take them and mix them in with Jergens because that's what I use. I use Jergens. I like that Jergens is very uh, gradual with their tanning process, and that's what I wanted in a self tanner, which I thought this was going to do, but it doesn't. But anyway, so I went in there getting. Um, the cover effects drops and a sales associate stopped me and she basically tried to convince me to get this. She won that battle, I lost, so I went out walking with this. Um, she did save me a lot of money though because the cover effects drops are like 45, give or take, $45, and this is only 25. But that being said, I really don't like this product. Um, when I put it on, it's very greasy. It's oily and it's very, um, I don't know how to describe it. It just doesn't dry down on my skin. I don't feel like my skin absorbs this very well. It does exactly what it says though. Like it gives a very, um, I'll do a little swatch in the back of my hand here. I mean, it gives an instant tan. Ooh, that was kind of a lot. See, it does do like an instant tan, but I was looking for something more gradual. But do you all see how like sticky and shiny that is? But for me, it's like this all night. It never fully dried down on my legs. And I remember being out with a friend and she was wearing white pants. I was wearing shorts and this, and I brushed up against her leg and this stuff just transferred all over her pant. And I felt so bad. I felt horrible. She had this like horrible, greasy, brown this all right this is a bad swatch I just realized this is way too much product so anyway this is not really what it looks like I just put too much on my hand but anyway on her leg was just this just brown this stuff basically and this was hours after I put it on it had been at least a couple hours and it just still was wet and sticky on my leg and it transferred everything it got in all in my clothes and the back of this does say, uh, let me just read it to you, apply onto clean, dry skin, smooth, blend, and layer to create looks and finish you desire. Wait until touch dry before getting dressed. To remove, simply wash off with soap and water. <sighs> okay, that was my fault. I put on clothes, but I did wait a long time for this to dry down, and it did not dry down, even after, even after hours I had had this on. So... If you like kind of emollient products like this, this might be great for you. I mean, it does have like a nice sheen to it. Um, it has that kind of goldish glitter thing going on in it. And I just, for me, I just didn't care for it. I like more of a lotion product. I like something like Jergens that's going to gradually make me tanner rather than like an instant um, I mean, yeah, I do want something instant, but I don't like that this washes off and then it's kind of like, okay, your tan is done for the night. I like Jergens because it's gradual and it stays on uh, for, even for several days after showering. Um, so that's really all I have to say about this. Um, I hope this was helpful for you all. Uh, if you like this type of product, go for it. This just personally, I didn't really care for it. 
That's just my opinion. But anyway, so that is my review for the St. Tropez One Night Only Gloss, and I hope you guys found this helpful. Bye!